Hey everyone! So, I recently came across this amazing flower pot design on Maker's World. It's inspired by Apple's HomePod and it looked perfect. But, when I tried scaling it up to fit my plant, it ended up too big for my bamboo printer. Classic, right? So, I thought, why not design my own version? And for that, I'm using Fusion 360. Step 1 drawing the profiles. All right, let's get started. First, we need to sketch two profiles for the pot, one for the inside and one for the outer design, which will have that cool HomePod inspired mesh. I jump into sketch mode and start with a simple rectangle from the origin point. Here are the dimensions. The inner radius is 85 millimeters. The height is 135 millimeters. To get the wall thickness right, I add 3mm to the radius, and for the pot's bottom, I add 10mm to the height. Next up is the speaker mesh profile. The mesh is 10mm wide and matches the height of the inner profile. I round off the top and bottom edges using arcs, 25mm up from the bottom and 10mm down from the top. Once the curves look just right, we're ready for the next step. Step two, revolving the profiles. Now it's time to turn our 2D sketches into 3D. I use the revolve tool. First, I select the inner profile. Then I choose an axis for the revolution and voila. Step three, hollowing out the pot. To hollow out the pot, I use the shell tool. I click on the top face of the pot and set the thickness to three millimeters, but we also need to trim the bottom a bit. I press E for the extend tool, select the bottom and set it to seven millimeters. Now the pot is hollow and ready for the next step. Before I can revolve the outer profile, I make the sketch visible again. From here, I repeat the revolve process to create the outer design. Make sure Operations is set to New Body, as we want to keep this separate from the inside. Before we create the mesh design, we need to separate the bottom. The bottom will stay solid, while the rest becomes a mesh. 1. Create an offset plane. Select the XZ plane and set an offset of 25mm. This matches the arc we sketched earlier. Use the Split Body tool. Select the outer body as the Body to Split and the Offset Plane as the Splitting tool. Now we have two separate parts, the bottom and the rest of the pot. Perfect. Step 5. Making the speaker mesh. Time for the cool HomePod style mesh. First, I'll hide the bottom and the inner body, so we're only working with the outer body. 1. Start a new sketch. Choose the XY plane. Project the outer body onto this sketch. Make sure the selection filter is set to body. Two, draw the mesh pattern. Start from the top corner and draw a line down at a 45 degree angle.
make the line 1.2 millimeters thick. Draw a 135 degree line back up and close the line. Press E, set the direction to symmetric, the operation to intersect, and extrude until the shape goes outside the body. Go to Pattern, Circular Pattern. Select the body and the axis and repeat the pattern until it looks good. I went with 65 repetitions. Turn the other parts back on and there you have it. A finished flower pot with a mesh design. Finally, I export the file as a step file load it into my slicer and let the magic happen. So, what do you think? Would you try making something like this? Let me know in the comments and don't forget to subscribe for more design projects like this one. See you in the next video. In the video description you'll find links to my model on Maker's World as well as the original model by the incredible HP Invent.